How's it going, everybody? My name is Sarah's 98 and um, today I'm playing Call of Duty World at War, and um, we're going to be playing a Zombies mod for it. Uh, the mod is called District 19. There will be a link in the description to the um, to the map, and um, also I may upload a video on how to install mods like zombies mods for Call of Duty World War. So, uh, basically once you got it installed, you go to mods, you load it up, Nazi Zombies District 19, you hit launch, and then it'll bring you to this page. You just hit play. It's if you want to do solo, which that's what I'm doing. Uh, so, we're going to play Activision. I mean, why not? <laughs> Activision. Um, so, I've played through this map once, and, um, so I guess this is going to be like a, a walkthrough-ish strategy guide-ish sort of, um, gameplay, because I kind of know what to do, because I've played twice. I mean, alright, just make sure this isn't too loud. Um, so I, I know what I'm doing on this map. I think I've been almost everywhere. I know how to do a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, it's basically for round one we're just gonna you know just chill around you know shoot them twice and knife. That's just what I do to get more points. You don't have to do this. That's just what I do. I mean And then, you know, just go around and kill them, you know. That's it for the first few rounds. And, um, yes, yeah, so the first few rounds are quite possibly the most boring. Because the windows are so spread out. And you have to go to all the different windows. And it just takes forever, so. Um, make sure I repaired the window completely. Now, oh, they're probably breaking in about now yeah almost all right let's just repair this up I think they have to tear down all these boards though on this window which is weird I've never seen a window like that all right um, oh there you are all right so reload all right that's the end of round one also, um, for the beginning, don't waste your points on buying this door right here, because instead of using that door, you can just come over to here, right over here. I believe it's open. Oh, uh, no, it's not. You have to, yeah, you have to, uh, clear the debris, but you can also use this as an alternate, like, staircase instead of over there if it gets too crowded on the staircase because I don't really like like stairways like that because they're just like I don't know I don't feel safe because they could come from anywhere alright so round two there's gonna be a lot more zombies alright so Round two. I stopped knifing after round one, usually. Unless I can get a few, you know, good shots in. Like that. Alright, so double points. I'm gonna... Whoops. Excuse me. Uh, Alright, this gun is really weird when you try to buy it. The gear... Pop some headshots. I'm not gonna let another headless body kill me again. That's how I died the last time. Shoot. Knife. Alright. That looks like it's gonna be good for round two. Alright. So, at about round three, you should be at around 3k points. So, this is when I'm gonna 
come over here and buy this store right here because also there's the box up here in this room so come here and buy the box real quick because there's really no good guns up here all right the bar it's nice um actually you have the choice between the box or the thompson right here and then also this is probably the best spot to do like a rape train on is up here on the roof um you unlock the roof once you like unlock the upstairs so all right and we just gotta kill some of the zombies up here i'm gonna try and leave a slow guy or a crawler or something so right now this guy looks like we're gonna keep him all right let's try and make a crawler out of him i'm bad at making crawlers ah no <sighs> all right whatever all right so we're just gonna keep one of these really slow zombies because i can't make a crawler to save my life all right so now we just gotta kill off all these zombies up here um wait for them all to make their way over here all right so I'm gonna do this for I think he's the last one nope alright so um there's apparently a lot more <laughs> not a lot more but there's more than just that one so you're going to come down here and uh, open up this door that I just opened up, like all the way downstairs. Then you're going to open up this power right here. Turn on the power. And once you've done that, um, you will see what I'm about to show you. So, another headless zombie got me. <laughs> oh my god, great. <laughs> so... Just as I was about to restart my recording and tell you guys that there are dog rounds. Um, a headless zombie got me. So, um, yeah. So what I was going to show you basically is that you open up, you like turn on the power and then it opens up a um, teleporter room. And um, basically, I'm going to do another video on this. Uh, District 19 I and in that video there will be like I'll start off at the teleporter room or at least at um the box not the box what am I saying at the power at the power there we go so I'll start off at the power this way y'all don't have to watch my boring commentary so um thanks for tuning in I will see you all next time and have fun playing District 19 Bye.